All right, so yesterday, Milton, when your daughter approached me, and as we often have during the rally, a lot of people come up to us wanting a balloon flight. Well, we can't entertain the masses because there's just too many people that want to do this bucket list item thing. But as soon as she told me that you were a 90-year-old World War II veteran, my heart poured open. I myself am a retired Air Force veteran. Several of us here have served as well, so I cannot say no. So throughout the day, we toiled with the weather forecast, hoping that we could make it happen. When we were at the field at Clackles, you and your family approached us, you still in your uniform from the parade earlier that day. It was a beautiful sight. We actually shared some war stories, and I think at one point you were about to call us all wimps for not flying because we thought it was windy. But the forecast uh, settled down, and we were able to make it happen, and it truly became a, a highlight of our entire week. <laughs>
I had a great time last night. Um, from the time you were able to jump into that basket and we shot out of there like a rocket, flying along and just talking to you, had a great time. Sir, you, you are wonderful. And um, I apologize for getting your feet wet up to your ankles. <laughs> but like I said, you needed baptized. And so. And he is Navy, so. And he is okay. Navy, yeah. So I just figured it was fitting. And then the landing, boy, you came through that like a trooper. We had Adam on board with us so that he kind of uh, helped you with the uh, that landing because it was, we kind of planted it a little bit. Could have been a little softer, but we were moving along um, pretty good speed. But my hat's off to you, Milton. Well, not yet. No, my hat's off to you, Milton. <laughs> you did a hell of a job, buddy. Okay, Milton, so this is for you. We celebrate you. We enjoyed sharing this weekend with you. 